Greetings to my problem solving in the challenges of the church class here at Moody Bible Institute Distance Learning. This is your instructor, Larry Asplund, coming to you at the end of week five and the beginning of week six. It's hard to believe that uh, we've had so many weeks already together. I really feel like we've hit our stride in this class. You're definitely uh, in, in the in the deep waters now as you work together and focus on some very real-world, real-life case studies. You know, I, I've wondered whether or not we would have the same uh, sense of freedom to honestly discuss some of these issues in a live classroom as we do here online. Anyway, I have been so impressed with your your wisdom and your sensitivity and your insights. I believe that we are not only uh, being able to process together some very sensitive but important issues in the church, but also we're learning from each other in the process. We're growing in wisdom and in sensitivity, and I think we're we're kind of gaining insights and skills that will just make us, you know, better pastoral leaders in the church, but also better church members with a new appreciation for what Christ can do in and through the body of Christ. So I want to thank you for your honest involvement with the uh, the conversations that we have been having. I so much appreciate the opportunity to participate with you and, and learn together, learn from you. So here we are as we go into the beginning of week six. Uh, I want to remind you, if I may, to, uh, first of all, when you write your paper, to submit it and then to attach a copy to a, to a uh, discussion board a thread and then, you know, from my practice, as you probably notice, I'm going to go in and grade your paper first, and then I'm going to a comment, post a comment on your discussion thread. And I just look forward to this whole process. So God bless you. I pray that you will continue to have wisdom and insight, uh, that you will have a sense that the Holy Spirit is opening up your, your understanding and is helping you really to see in a way that will not only, you know, meet the need of this class, but will meet the need of the body of Christ in the years that you are uh, that are ahead. So I pray that you have a wonderful week. God bless you, and uh, may you know God's peace this coming week.